Welcome to Old Biloxi Cemetery. It's time for the annual cemetery tour. Thanks for staying with us on the 4 o'clock show. I'm here with Cecilia Dobbs Walton with the city of Biloxi. This, Cecilia, is always a great event. Oh, it is. You know, Biloxi is filled with history and having these cemetery tours and having reenactors. It's like the cemetery's coming to life. It's always a fun event. Yeah. And in cemeteries, really so much history of a community, of a, the city of Biloxi in this case, can be found. You're right. Of course, the city of Biloxi was founded in 1699. You know, our oldest part of the cemetery is, you know, right by Highway 90. But again, it's the old Biloxi Cemetery Tours and the old Biloxi Cemetery. There's so much history that's going on that it, that is in this cemetery. And it's a great way to tell the story and the history of Biloxi and the culture of Biloxi by having a cemetery tour and having people actually reenact the lives and the history of people that's buried in the cemetery. And you have some great people doing that this year. Um, and I think that really, as you say, helps bring it to life as they reenact that period in history. What do they seem to enjoy about it, the actors? Well, we have a lot of repeat actors, so that tells you a lot, you know. And of course, um, just being able to tell a story, they get to dress up, they get to learn about people in the cemetery. Some people are family members, some people it's not. It's just somebody that they are reenacting, and they really get into character. I mean, when you're walking through this, because it's a self-guided tour on two days, you really feel like, you're learning and living the history of that person. And each year there's a theme, and I believe the theme this year is love stories of Biloxi. So how do you bring that particular theme to life? Well, some of our reenactors are in those couples, so they're going to tell about the history. You know, and being in the cemetery, of course, a lot of people, when they get buried, they're buried by a spouse or a loved one. So it's fitting. They're right there in the same area. We have one to two um, reenactors that actually will just bring that couple, bring that family to life and tell their story. That's the headstone of Dr. William Tisdale, buried here in Old Biloxi Cemetery. Here with his descendants, City Councilman Paul Tisdale and his sister Jill. Good to see both of you. Paul, first of all, give me a line that you'll be doing when you're portraying uh, your dad. Okay, well, shortly after graduating from high school, I joined the Navy. They gave you three meals a day, a set of uniforms, and they paid you. Yeah. How about that, Dave? Uh, tell me a little bit about your dad. Uh, he was, uh, he grew up in Summerall, Mississippi the first few years of his life and then was here in Biloxi. Went to Tulane and uh, came back to open his practice. Had his, uh, delivered a couple of thousand babies here on the coast. Worked in emergency medicine for most of his career at uh, Howard Memorial Hospital and Gulf Coast Community Hospital. But uh, a lot of folks knew him. Joe, why is this important to y'all uh, as descendants to kind of pay tribute to your dad? Because that's really what this is. Well, my parents were of the generation known as the greatest generation. And they had an incredible sense of loyalty and duty. They were totally devoted to each other, married for 56 years. And I think their love story fits in with the theme this year of Biloxi love stories. Now this time of year, dusk sets in pretty early. So, you know, being in a cemetery and mm -hmm. it's just beginning mm -hmm. to get dark, uh, it's really enjoyable uh, for families and for everybody else to just kind of come out and experience this. I think the setting is perfect this time of year. Yep, well, of course, it's October. Everybody's getting ready for the Halloween season. So having a, a tour in the cemetery, some people may be weary of it, but it is a family event. Event. You know, it is fun. It's not scary. It's not creepy. It's a fun storytelling event. Walking around, you know, we have two tours. One's going to be from 2 to 4 um, on the 22nd, and then one from 5 to 7. So that's going to get a little bit in the dark. So it may be a little creepy, you know, walking around the cemetery, but it's still going to be fun. Yeah, I've been to that Biloxi Cemetery tour, and the actors dress up and they portray the person. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. There. They have some good They do their own research there. and come up with their own lines. Yeah, Mike Lacey, you said, is going to be Former WLOX <laughs> anchor is going to be there. Again, the 17th annual Old Biloxi Cemetery Tour scheduled from 2 to 4. That's on October 22nd this weekend, and then they'll do it again next Tuesday from 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. Yeah, always a lot of fun.